All right, what's up, guys? I'm Brock F. Sampson. Thought I would give you some tips on Nuka World on here that, you know, I just got done playing through the first part of it, and this is the stuff that will make it really easy on you if you just want to do it. Number one, bring plenty of stem packs. These traps and stuff, I mean, you may be good about walking slow. I'm impatient, so I just tear out through there, and you hit a lot of traps. I did die a few times, but once I got used to what's going on, I stopped dying. And then, number two, bring a fat man. You, no, I'm not talking about me. I'm talking about the gun, a fat man. Because at the end, you find a couple of mini nukes, or at the end of the first part of it, you find a couple of mini nukes, but there's I couldn't find a launcher in there. So, you know, if you have somebody coming with you, like I had Ada with me, give it to her and let her carry it till you get to the end. Just make sure you send her through doors before you go through that way she don't get trapped and you get locked out from your fat man. But don't use it until the boss battle. All right. And then three, take door number one out of three. You'll know what I'm talking about. You come to a spot where there's three red doors. Door number one is the easiest. I mean, none of them have traps. It's necessarily going to kill you. But door number one is the one you got to go through. Door number four, listen to the dude at the end. When you get to the end, there's a guy on the intercom. He tells you there's a gun hidden in there. It's a little squirt gun. It's a red gun. It's, I can't even remember what it starts with a T. I can't remember the name of it. But get the squirt gun. I mean, because it will help you out in the end. And uh, that's pretty well the four best tips I can think to give you for Fallout uh, for Nuka World. So take or leave the vice. But if you do those things right there, you're going to be fine. I mean, the last boss, or not, he's not the last boss, but the boss you fight, he is not hard, you know, and I did it with uh, just limited ammo because I'd actually, most of my guns I've modified to use the same ammo, you know, so I run out of ammo. But I still managed to beat him. And uh, like I said, he's he's not hard, but if you bring the fat man, you get a couple mini nukes you can use, and then you got the squirt gun, to, uh, you just shoot him with a squirt gun. He's got electricity running into a suit and it shorts the suit out and then you can attack him with whatever and hit him with a mini nuke and it'll be over with. Just make sure he's far enough across the screen. All right, guys. I'm Brock Sampson for uh, Geek Recording Goons. Check us out on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter. Pretty well, if it's somewhere where you can have an account, we got one made up. And we'll see you next time.